This is Rob and I wanted to share with you uh, an update I made to a tool I've been using with different uh, schools since the new uh, form ranger that has been made allows you to update your drop down questions easily from your form directly. So here's the form I have. It's used for um, tracking behavior incidences at a school. The form itself looks like this where you would select the teacher of the student, type in the student's name, select their grade, the location of the incident, um, any other information about the incident, such as who's reporting, um, any witnesses, and the type of misbehavior that it was so that a school can do some document collection and tracking of uh, incidences and maybe take a look and see is where they need to focus some of their efforts. Um, it even has a selection down here on whether the principal's office um, was visited or not and additional comments. And when you click submit on that form, it will create a um, an incident where the data is collected in the spreadsheet. And at the same time, it does a VLOOKUP to replace the teacher name with their email so that it can send the teacher an email with the classroom and it sends also an email to uh, the principal. And that could be set up um, so that it's only sent to the principal if the principal's office is visited, but for most of the schools I've worked with, they always wanna be notified. Um, so I used to have to go in and edit the drop-down list all the time, but now with the new Form Ranger tool that uh, um, has been made, it's easy just to keep that list updated right here and to share this document out with people. So a school only needs to enter their teacher names and I just have a few entered here and their e corresponding emails so that when the form is submitted, if I were to change this here and add a new person like Bob, that new name will show up over here when I refresh or when I go to submit that document for the first time. And you see Bob has been added to the list here, as well as Bob has been added to the list down here for reporting adult options. And the school can set that up differently if they wanted to, but for my examples, usually the teachers are the same ones. You just want to know is it the classroom, who the classroom teacher is compared to the other teachers. So that has been a huge improvement on uh, maintaining some of these forms and actually making the forms so that uh, it's easy for the users, the end users, to keep those forms updated. So uh, I thank Andrew for his cool script that he wrote, um, the Form Ranger, and uh, also Form Mule that is used in this document for generating the email template that is just set up to email that corresponding information that is submitted. Uh, it has made life a lot easier for me to uh, help schools use these tools for data collection. So uh, those are some ideas. I'll put this uh, link to this um, template out there for anyone who cares to take a look at it or use it. You're welcome to and be happy to answer any questions about it if you had any.